this is Arshia and today I'm going to be showing you how to bake your makeup to make it last all day long also to brighten up underneath the eyes which is such a big concern I know for a lot of people including myself and I have partnered with CoverGirl to show you exactly how to do that using some amazing amazing new products that I know for a fact that all of you will love just as much as I do so with that being said let's get right into the video so first thing I'm going to do is take the True Blend Base Business Primer and this is the moisturizing primer. So it's going to prime my skin for any makeup that I put on top and moisturize my skin without any greasiness or oiliness. So I'm just taking a little bit of product, applying it all over my face and then blending it and massaging it in with my fingers. So for my foundation today, I am going in with the True Blend Matte Made Foundation. And this is in shade T30, which is such a good match for my skin tone. So you guys are gonna see when I blend it all out that it completely disappears into my skin, which I love. So I'm just taking a beauty sponge and really pressing the foundation into my skin. And this is my favorite technique to apply my foundation and my base because I find that using a beauty sponge and really pressing the foundation into your skin makes it part of your face. And that's exactly what I'm doing. And you can see the color match is epic. It's so, so, so good for my skin tone. Okay, the next product I'm so excited to introduce to you guys because it is a game changer. This is the new CoverGirl True Blend Undercover Concealer, and I'm gonna use the shade Golden Amber, which is just a few shades lighter than my skin tone, but I do like to use concealers to brighten my skin. In fact, I'm gonna actually just do it like a before and after so you can really see how effective and amazing this concealer is. So first things first, it does have a really oversized doe foot applicator, which makes it so easy for you to apply on your skin. And I'm just gonna go ahead and start to actually apply it underneath my eyes first. And then I take my beauty sponge and blend this out. And you guys are gonna see how easily and how quickly this just blends out. It's full coverage, but still feels so lightweight does not feel heavy or cakey on the skin and blends out immediately. And I hope that all of you can see the difference between this side of my face and this side of my face. This side of my face just looks so much lifted, brighter, and more awake. So I really love this concealer. I also forgot to mention, but it is available in 30 shades. So everyone out there should definitely be able to find something that works for them. Okay, I'm gonna quickly just do the same thing on the other side as well just to keep things nice and even. Also just gonna take a little bit of product and apply it on the bridge of my nose to also highlight here. Taking my beauty sponge, I am blending it out and I just love the fact that the concealer just blends out so easily and quickly. And now let's get into actually baking our makeup. And I'm gonna use the new CoverGirl True Blend Minerals Loose Mineral Powder. And I'm gonna use the shade Banana. This is also available in six other shades. Depending on your skin tone or your preference, I'm actually gonna use the shade Banana because it has kind of this very subtle yellow tint, which is amazing if you wanna brighten up underneath the eyes as well. So what I'm gonna do is just take a little bit of this loose powder. I always just like to take it directly from the lid of the loose powder and really press it into my beauty sponge. And then looking down to make sure there's no creasing underneath the eyes, press this very gently underneath my eyes. I'm actually just gonna take whatever is left on my um, beauty sponge and apply it on my nose as well. Basically all the areas that I applied my concealer, I'm just applying my powder and we're just gonna let it sit while we do the rest of the makeup. So usually I like to let my um, under eye powder bake for about three minutes max. Um, if you want, you can let it sit there longer. For me, three minutes is more than enough. And then of course, I'll wipe it off and I'll show you guys what the after effect is. But this technique just makes my under eye area look so bright and awake. And it sets the makeup and concealer in place so that it doesn't move throughout the day at all. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and finish off the rest of my makeup. I'm gonna quickly just use the new Full Spectrum Lash Ambition Mascara. This gives you such doll-like, big, voluminous lashes. And as you guys can see, I really like 
to coat my lashes a bunch. But the best part is this does not clump up your lashes whatsoever, even with all of the layers that I'm doing right now. But it's been a good like three minutes or so since I've had the loose powder underneath the eyes. And now it is time to finally wipe it off using any beauty brush that you have. And again, just very gently sweep it away. And you can see by doing this technique, it also just gives you like a very, very subtle glow underneath the eyes and makes your under eye area or wherever you apply your bake to appear brighter, which I love. Okay, so I went ahead and applied my bronzer, my blush, and all that stuff. And I wanna show you another area of your face that you can bake and also make your contour appear sharper. Now I'm going in with the translucent baking powder and I'm gonna just go ahead and apply this directly underneath my contour like this. So while this is setting, I'm gonna go ahead and just finish the rest of my makeup. So for my highlight today, I am using the True Blend Super Stunner Hyper Glow Highlight, and this is in the shade Pearl, stunning on my skin tone. And I barely even touch my brush, and you can see it's so insanely pigmented. I quickly just went and smoked out and finished my entire eyes, face, everything. We just need to quickly wipe this off, and again, using the same brush that I used underneath my eyes, I am just going to quickly wipe this off. And you can see it just really, really defines your contours so much more. Okay, so here is the final look. I also did go ahead and apply lipstick. Today I am using the Full Spectrum CoverGirl lipstick in the shade Royalty, which is one of my favorite lipsticks in my collection. It's such a good shade that I just love for my skin tone. And I also really like the formula of these because these are super pigmented, very creamy, and long lasting, but they don't feel uncomfortable on the lips and definitely don't like crack or break throughout the day. So love these and definitely recommend them. So that is officially it for this video. I hope you guys found it useful. If you did, don't forget to thumbs up and leave us a comment in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.